Muddy, our seven-year-old three-striped mud turtle, laid five eggs on March 31st. Four were fertile and they started hatching in late June, the last hatching a week into August, which is somewhat unusual. Uh, they're all healthy, as you can see here. The last one, uh, hatchling number four, uh, turned out to be a real climber. They were released at a large lake here in Florida uh, yesterday. Here, up in the upper left-hand corner. Okay, you can follow me out here. Okay, here we go. We're going to let these guys go. Pretty nice out here. Okay. Okay, you guys, are you ready? Here we go. Come on. Don't be afraid. Here we go. There goes one. Come on. Don't dig into my hand. You're supposed to leave. Hurry up. Come on. Come on, you two. Let's go. There goes that one. Come on, little number four. Off we go. There you go. How about that? See if I can get underwater focus or not. Yeah, I think I got, there he goes. See him in the lens there? Oh, yeah. Aww. How are we doing in there? You're going to be okay. You just be careful. There's another one up oh, ahead I of him. Oh, look at him. There he goes. Wow. He's way up there. Come on. You get out of there. Now get out of that little spot and get underneath uh, the wood here. You'll be safer. Come on. Get on over the get over the wood. Come on. You can get out. Don't want to get staying in there. You're too vulnerable. There we go. There we go. Okay. They're good. Now we need to step out carefully here. Big giant step out. Ah, there. There's a spot. Looking out there, lots of tall reeds and grasses in the water. Lots of vegetation here, which is good. And here we have a nice big palmetto plant that provides shade and cover, and lots of uh, dead palmetto leaves uh, on the bottom there on part of the tree or brush or bush, whatever you want to call it, which will provide cover. And uh, some wood in there. And, uh, they're going to miss us for a couple days. They have to feed themselves now. Okay, you guys. Good luck.